friend told me about this plugin here, Palm Tab, and I really want to try it because it has a more uh, advanced search. You, you can search by type, which will help me uh, on my timeline files. But what I really liked here is this. I, I, I haven't tried yet. This here search, you can embed the search bar. And as you know, I have my own home page and I want to try adding this to my home page with everything else that I that I already have there. But there is a little concern here because if we go all the way to the beginning of the, the plugin page here, not currently maintained. So I'll first try this on my second account and let's see how it goes. Install and enable. Okay, let's go to the options now. I'm gonna leave everything as is, especially because this first one here, replace new tabs with home tab. This will open the search every time we create a new tab. I don't want this, but it's just to show you. So from here, I can search for anything. Let's say tart, this is gonna show me the file and it will show me where it is. And I can use the arrows to navigate up and down. Enter will open, shift uh, will create, control to open a new tab, control enter, shift enter, of course, and ask to dismiss. I wish I could swipe this ones here. I, I would prefer to always enter and open in a new, in a new tab. But let's try here, uh, control enter. Control. It is control. Yes, it is control. Enter. I guess on the Mac it might be common. Enter. Yeah, on the Mac it it's com common. Enter, not control. Enter. By the way, if you are a supporter on Patreon or YouTube, go watch the B side video and laugh at me trying to figure out everything details like this. The common and control. <laughs> it was crazy. Okay, let's go back here to the home page. And I want to try now uh, the shortcuts. You can select the type of search, for example, PDF, and then tab will tell the search that we, we want to search only PDFs. So I know that there is a manual here. And again, we can see here where the files are and all the PDFs that have the this letters. I wish I could select the folder and also the folder, not only the type of, of files, but this is already pre pretty cool image, image tab. And now all sorts of images. I don't know. Let's use the letter A. Okay, we have here JPEGs and PNGs. Okay, let's go to the settings and see everything that we can that we can uh, search using this shortcuts. So markdown files, images, videos, audio, PDFs, and canvas very very good and here images all this formats video all this formats audio all this formats i love it okay now i want to try this because this is what made me want to use this so let's copy this go back to home and in this case oh let first let's turn that off i don't i don't want it to uh Yes, I don't want it opening tabs, so it's not going to open anymore because I want to put it here. So this is what we have now. Search bar, turn it on, and only only the search bar without the logo and everything that we just saw, the, the Obsidian logo and all that information above the search bar, and show start files. Pin that for a moment. We'll get back to it. So now if we... Click there, we have here the search box, and I love it. Uh, to be honest with you, uh, I, 
uh, I'm not going to wait anymore. As soon as I finish this video, <laughs> I'm going to add this to my main account. But if we do the, the, the same search here, it, it will work exactly the same way. So uh, the files, the, 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 the folders, the files, everything is here just like before, minus the, 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 the logo, because we if we remove this, you see that the logo will be there, only the search bar. So now we have the logo, okay? There's no need for that here. But there's one more thing that we can add here. I'm gonna show you where to find it because maybe you wanna go there in the future. But if you go to the plugins and go to home tab and instructions here, it says that you can add show recent files, okay? I'm copying that because I want to show you another thing. Let's go to the home tab uh, settings here now and scroll down. Uh, show bookmarked files, show recent files. This is the search the that you see below the search bar, every recent search. And he search, yeah, the searches you performed. And here, the last recent file. This has nothing to do with the search. Any file you open will be there. This is what we just copied that the command. So uh, I'll keep this 10. It, it was five before. Okay, let's add that here. And now all the files I just opened before they are here. So let, let, let's do something here. Let, oh, let's open another file here. For example, uh, family, I don't know, grocery store. And now if we go back here, here, here it is. This is so cool. <laughs> okay, now this here should be the bookmarks. I have a bookmark here. I added one just, just to, to show you, but it's not working. This because bookmarks they were called start files in the past, and it should be showing us the bookmark files. If we go back here and turn on this new tab thing that will open the search, and I open a new one here, as you can see, it's showing here. So it, it in a way it works, but it's not working embedded. And I would love to have my bookmarks here because that would mean that I I I I could just ignore this <laughs> and have everything on my home page. But I guess we're not getting this because the developer is not working on this for now. And by the the name he used here because this was this changed a while ago. This tells me that it's been a while since he touched this for the last time, or it doesn't matter. The name doesn't matter. I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, uh, I can now remove this plugin here because this one here would show me my recent files here. I don't need that anymore because I can see them here. So let's remove that community plugins and this is a, a very good plugin, but I don't need two plugins doing the same thing. And now after editing this, I'm going to set up my main account just like this one here. If it was helpful, I'd appreciate a thumbs up. And if you want to help even more, please consider supporting my work on Patreon or YouTube. Thanks for watching. See you soon.